How y'all doing? How y'all doing? It's your boy AD and that's all day. What's going on? I wanted to give my quick little first thoughts on WWE 2K22. I know I'm all outside, cars going past and shit. But um, yeah, I just got it last night. I told y'all I was going to get it. I was just waiting, you know. But I knew I wanted to get it though. And I played it last night for a little while. I didn't have a lot of time to go into all the modes and stuff like that yet. But but I did play some matches though. You know what I'm saying? And I could see what a lot of people are talking about now when they say it comes to like the controls. And is it like a wrestling game or is it like a fighting game? <laughs> I could kind of get that now because it does kind of have a lot of fighting game implements to it like even the way like even the way your bars work in the game like you know how in fighting games a lot of fighting games you got bars and you got meters and depending on how much meter you guys is what you can do and in this game it's kind of like that you can i know they've done it in other ones but this one is a little bit more different and then you can hit them with like a signature to build your finisher even though your finisher can go i do feel like the moves have a nice little impact to them, especially the finishers. Now, reversals, though, is something to get used to. And, and doing the uh, signatures and all that other stuff. Because you got a whole right trigger or a right button or whatever you plan on. Then you got to hit X or, you know, or A. And that's kind of weird, too. The new combo system, like with the attacks, like you would think it would be like X, Y. No, it's X, A, and then B is to grab. Okay, that's okay. But then you got to hit X and A afterwards. So it's no like hit B or circle, then hit up B, down B. No, you hit that. Then you got to hit like that with X or A. So that's the little, you know, that might be one of the things people got to get used to in the combo system. Because you could reverse just like in any other wrestling game. You could reverse grabs. Well, not any other one, but a lot. You can reverse grabs and strikes with the same button, which is why you could block and move while you block. I find that to be really interesting. Like, damn, you can actually move while you block now. Like, I see where people are coming from. Because it do kind of got that element. And you know it's 3D, so you know you can move around while you're blocking. You could dodge now. You can mix combos up into grabs. Like you could do light combos, light mixed with heavy combos, light heavy grab combos. That's like some new type of stuff. But that's pretty cool. Now again, I ain't tried all the modes yet. I think, I think I'm gonna make another video too. Cause we was thinking about this last night. I think I'm going to make another video where I go through a lot of the wrestlers and the characters and I could critique how good they really look, you know, compared to how they do in real life. Because that's another thing I got to say. I don't want to make this too long because I might talk about this some more. But, um, yeah, man, it's like some of the characters don't really look that great. And it's kind of crazy how we're in 2022. And you got mugs out here. You got mugs out here. Um, still, still rocking the um, the two two thousand and one, two thousand and two cut. Oh, I got watch where I'm stepping right now. Still white rocking the two. I swear, some of that hair on some of them people look like it's still two thousand and one on the PS2. Like what the hell? And some people just look. Like, it's something going on. Like, not everyone. But some people in this game just got a baby face. Like, everybody got this young baby face. Like, certain... I'm gonna make a people uh, another video about this. But thank y'all for watching. These are my first impressions. I gotta show y'all. Because I might do that later on some turn. And show y'all, like, look how these mugs look. Alright, I'm gonna let y'all. Peace out.